welcome back to oil drip my name is Julie Johnston if you haven't caught in one of our oil drip chats here before today we are talking about using essential oils this summer to help keep our kids busy and um, earlier this week we put up a post with a recipe on how to make your very own homemade play-doh using essential oils in the mix and um, if you've never made this recipe before, we've done it quite a few times um, here in our house. And um, it is a really nice Play-Doh. It comes out real nice and soft. And when you add your um, essential oils to it, then it has that great fragrance. So it can um, be a great way to uplift somebody's mood who might be really bored now that it's summertime. They have nothing to do. If your kids are anything like mine, then that is a common theme that um, we get what's what's next on the agenda what are we going to do today so mixing it up by making um, a craft using your essential oils can always be fun so I wanted to add on one more craft that um, my kids love and I'm thinking your kids will love too it's easy and um, it's it's not messy and it has a great benefit to it as well now that we are finding our side, ourselves outside a lot having um, fires in the evenings maybe roasting some marshmallows but having those unwanted um, mosquito bites is never any fun so this craft will help you be prepared to um, fight off those mosquitoes so keep them all away from you so the craft is making a bracelet and these are really easy to do you just have to go and get um, your selection of beads that you want to use and we've gotten beads at Hobby Lobby that's the closest store to um, us out here and so we've gone there and gotten these different mixture of beads so they can make whatever design they want um, there's also I know my kids like these now too they're making a lot of bracelets with these little round discs I don't I don't exactly know what they call these but this seems to be popular now and then um, they have the clear jewelry bracelet wire that you can get and um, this is perfect for making these bracelets you just make sure you cut the length that you would need that would fit around your wrist and be able to tie it in a knot and get it on and off so make sure you, you cut the correct size before you start making it and then um, just kind of lay out your beads and whatever design you like and then start slipping them on now the key to the beads are or the key to using your essential oil with your bracelets are what are called the lava beads and these we found at um, Hobby Lobby but I'm sure you could go on Amazon and get a whole bunch of them on there as well these will actually hold your essential oils um, in them so you'll have that oil and that'll help repel those mosquitoes from you now the oil that you choose to put on your bracelet is up to you and um, you could just simply use your tear shield and um, spray that on your fingers and then rub it on those black lava beads or if you don't have tear shills and maybe you just have some of our other bug repelling oils you could choose from your lemon eucalyptus from citronella or you can also choose lemongrass you could also use peppermint if you don't like the smell of any of these peppermint would be a good one you could even do lavender if you wanted but these are going to be stronger um, Arbor Vitae is another good oil that's great for repelling um, mosquitoes. And if you wanted, you could combine all of these so that you had a powerful bracelet that you could use when you go outside. So that's just another tip for you to um, have something useful, but also give your kids something fun to do and look forward to. Um, even sharing this at, uh, we've had like Girl Scouts we've had little events where the Girl Scouts are making jewelry and then they'll use the essential oil that they love and put it on the beads but it could be a birthday party where you put together their own little bracelets and and share your essential oils with them the little girls there too and you can make masculine bracelets if you wanted to as well if you have boys who want to um, make some sort of bracelet 
All right, well, that is my tip for today. Hopefully, everyone is aware that today, being July 1st, the first day of the month, that it is also the first day that we can get into our doTERRA um, shopping websites and purchase the brand new doTERRA sun care products. And that is your um, lotion, stick, and spray, or yeah, I think it's called a spray, not a mist. Those are all three available today, and starting August 1st, we'll have our after sun spray available. But those, those products are all in there, they're ready to ship, and um, I can't wait to get mine and start using it and smell it and see um, just how wonderful it is. I hope you caught all the education that we provided over in our um, partnering uh, customer group to Team Flight Essentials. We had tons of information over there this week. If you missed it, you can always go back over there and go through the post and find videos that we put up and um, all the education we put on there about not just doTERRA's sun uh, care products, but um, other things like food that protects your skin, um, the amount of sunlight you should get, what are the benefits of sunlight, what time of day is the best time to go out? Why our SPF is only 30, 40? Why isn't it higher? All of that research uh, is, is over there and I'm ready to educate you so you know that the products that doTERRA has provided for us have been really well thought out. Lots of science goes into that and research and everybody's been waiting for these essential oils for years I've been in doTERRA now, my gosh, I think it's like 13 years, and uh, since way back in the beginning, people have been asking, do we have a natural sun care line? So we finally have it. I think doTERRA wanted to not put out something until it was proven to be very beneficial, be very good for our health, um, overall great for our skin, not just protecting it from the sun, but a very nourishing, moisturizing product that they're giving us. And I am super excited to try it. I hope you all are as well. So make sure you jump in um, your website, check out those products. You can buy them all individually and um, try them out one by one if you want, or order the whole set and get it all here and use it um, as you need. All right, well, I hope you're all having a wonderful summer. Um, definitely missing Linda Pick and Paul today. She's always a great um, asset to these chats. It's more fun to talk with her than it is to talk at everyone. But I, I hope you enjoy this information and we will be back to talk to you again very soon. Bye now.